Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome. Welcome to Stock Swiss Show Market Review of the SPY. What an amazing bullish day in the market today. Incredible. It just makes me smile so huge. If you can see my face right now, I'm just glowing. Uh, amazing. Saw this within the first 10 minutes of the day that that was the low of the day in the market. I said the market would rally. Although I did, when I called the market this morning long and to hold, I said we would do this this week. But I, I, I said there was only a small chance that we do this today. <laughs> we did it today. I mean, I knew we'd do this this week. But I didn't know exactly, even though I knew we'd hold today bullishly, I didn't know exactly that we would do this kind of move today. And we did. We did it. We're doing it. This is amazing. No turning back to the market. And at one point then this morning, I don't know what time it was. It was after 10 o'clock. And I said, you know, just buy every pullback in the market today. I even thought the market would fake on a 15 minute today. It didn't even do that. I knew that if it faked, I knew that if we did a trigger in the 15 minute, like we were going to break, that we would flip. But I knew when we got over 207, we would blow. And that is exactly, exactly what happened. Here's 207. I said, once we get out 207, we're going to blow. Look, look what we did. After we got up over 207, we literally just blew. Woo! Went all the way up. We will close looking very much like this. Very similar to this or larger than this and very similar to this. And we could just continue. Continue. It's 1 o'clock. We could just rally, 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 rally forever here until 4 o'clock. What an amazing bullish move in the market. So again, when I got up in the morning, I looked at the gap. I just want to be clear, the market gap down. Can you short every gap down? No. Can you buy every gap up? No. That's why I have a criteria to rate the gap. And you can use it for ETFs, for example, the market. So I've been looking at the SPY this morning. If you would have rated the gap, you would have known this wasn't a short. And I did say the market would hold today, which it did. And I said there was a small possibility the market could have a massive green day today. Although I really thought it was such a stinky uh, area, meaning that the area of the gap this morning, the gap down, even though I said it would hold, that it would be hard for this to hold. But that, the the fact that we held, the fact that we held right into 932, the fact that we rallied aggressively at that moment, the fact that we held so beautifully and so strong and are rallying like we are today in a stinky place, okay, because we did gap down gives me the confirmation and 100% conviction of how strong this market is, which I've been saying all along, okay? And I'm going to continue to say that. I just saw something here, and I just decided this video, I just saw a number that I never saw before, 315. So, again, <laughs> this is just like, this market's going to run for a while. This market's going to run all of this year, 2015. It's going to run for a couple of years after that, longer than I thought that it would, which I did say a few videos back. Uh, 350. I believe that 350 will be hit in the market at some point. So let's just get together here. Geez, I'm seeing all kinds of numbers. I have to write this down. Just all kinds of things are coming to me here. I just got to write this down right now. Okay, I'm not giving any timeline for these numbers. I just want to make this clear right now because. I'm just seeing so far ahead in this moment here in my mind about how this price is acting. First of all, 2015 is going to be a bullish year, which I predicted last fall, okay? That will follow through all year, even though everyone thinks we're going to crash, that isn't going to happen. I just saw some really big numbers in my mind here. Let me just look at something here. This is really exciting that I'm seeing this stuff so far in advance. I mean, it is really exciting. This, this level here, okay, is going to hold in the market for probably all this year, and it, this level in the market could hold for several years. I just saw in my mind that the SPY is going to reach 500, and I have no idea when that happens. And I'm, I'm, that's not this year, 2015. I'm saying the SPY, ever, ever, okay, let's just, I just wrote some notes down. Let's just backtrack. The market 
is going to continue to rally 2015. It's going to continue to rally. And I know a little couple weeks ago, two weeks ago, whenever I did a video, it's the date's online on YouTube, I realized that the rally is going to continue past 2015. Now, my call is still the SPY can hit 300 by the end of 2015. But even if it doesn't, the market's going to continue to rally because I saw something that the market's going to continue to rally for a long time here now, meaning that it could last for several years. There's a possibility that the SPY could hit 500 before it ever even turns trend again, meaning goes from an uptrend to a downtrend. I, I just I just saw that. So this is th these are really big numbers. That means that the SPY would more than double. And th th I mean, this could be within the next one to five years, I'm just saying. But I'm saying this because everyone keeps thinking the market's extended is going to crash, and it is not. Not only is it not extended, this level here in the market, <clears throat> and this is what I saw a couple weeks ago, Okay, it's going to hold for a very long time, actually. So this is a new buying point here for the market that you could be in for potentially years. Now, I'm not getting this from today, but today is definitely helping me see some, some things that I didn't see before that I just wrote down. So the market, the next target, okay, is 215. For right now, in the moment, the next target for the SPY is 215, 220, 225. I don't know how we're going to act at those numbers, and I have to see when we hit those numbers. I think now at this point we're going to hit right up and through those numbers. Uh, possibly in the next 30 days we will hit through those numbers. In other words, the market is definitely in the month of April going to be very bullish and hit up and make a new high in the spot. I don't know whether that happens this week, but quite frankly it could. Quite frankly it could. It could very well happen this week. All right. All of a sudden today, I'm seeing numbers that I just never saw before. 315, 315 and 350, absolutely. But I am just saw so far ahead now, I just saw the possibility of 500. And again, this is not this calendar year. This is like a rally that's going to continue for years. And this is really, this is really going to hold. This is actually going to hold. This is, wow, I just, I just, I just saw something else here today. Does anyone even realize how great this stuff is that I see so far in advance? I mean, I don't, I don't, I realize it. I, I realize it. I realize it. I think the people that trade with me realize it. I don't know if anyone that watches my videos realize it. The, the fact that I have the ability to see what the market's going to do before it does it, and, not, and, and it's like I'm seeing it even so far in advance now. For everyone that was on my list in December, I called that the SPY would be bullish this year, and the market, and the, and the QQQs and the SPY. I saw it in September, but in December I wrote that email. And I'm telling you that all those targets are still in play yet for this year. Whether they meet those exact numbers by the end of this calendar year or not, it doesn't matter. It's going to carry through now even more than I thought. And I saw this within the last few weeks. This level here, I'm saying, is going to hold for a, well, for a long time. Okay. And this is a new level in the market. This is what this, 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 this is. Okay. That's why I'm saying it's going to hold. It's a new level that's going to hold. And... It's the starting point of something big, <laughs> which I saw, like I said, like two or three weeks ago, whenever I did the video where I saw it. Oh my gosh. The, I, I know every, this is really, this, I'm seeing stuff so far in advance here now. The, the market's going to continue to rally and it could last for years. And, and, this, and I know everyone thinks the market's going to crash. It's not going to anytime soon. I know everyone thinks the market's extended. It's not. This is a new buy point in the market that I see with massive potential. I just saw the potential in it. I just saw this today. That I knew there was, I knew the market would continue higher, but I just saw something for this level to hold that has such massive potential that the stock market price could actually more than double from the level that I'm seeing here today from the price point. And I'm speechless almost here. Wow, is this going to be unexpected for people? The, the move the market's going to make, and I said that last year. And I said it all in this year, and I said it last year even too. I said it all year last year, but really when I saw it in September and then December when I did the email, 
I, this is going to be so unexpected for people. This is the move the market's going to make from this placement is going to be so unexpected for people. Unless you see what I see and have the ability to see what I see in a reprice like me, this is even today. This is unexpected for people. Although I knew we would hold like this this week, I even I, you know, didn't know that we would hold this aggressively today. Although I said there was a chance we could, and I did call the market long very early in the first ten minutes of the day. And this is on a gap down. I just want to ver you know, remind everyone of that. This is a gap down that took place in the market today. The market closed on Thursday at 206.43 and it opened at 205.37. The market gapped down more than a dollar this morning and did this bullish move today. So you must know how to qualify and rate gaps before you determine what to do with them, buy them, or sell them. It is so important to be on the side of institutional money. This is institutional buying here today, and by golly, it's new buying. I saw that this morning. I saw it hold very quickly. Is that I was an indicator? No. But the overall chart is, okay, which I'm seeing here. And I just saw something here that I never saw before today, which is that the potential for the market, for the rally, for the move that it's going to make far exceeds what I even initially thought, which was a, which was a big, large move for this calendar year. And it far exceeds it. It's going to far exceed to anyone's wildest dreams what the market's going to do in the rally. <laughs> Wow. I I don't know if anyone but me realizes how amazing it is that I can see this so far in advance and so accurately to predict it. And so quickly when I see the things set up on the day, it's, there's two things I have the ability to do. One, see things in the live time to call them, to take them, to see them, that they're going to do what they're going to do on the live day, which I called the market very early this morning. We'll go back and look at the more minute chart. And then secondly, to see the targets which I do teach in the class, but thirdly, and last but not least, my ability to be able to see things far in advance. This is like going to be so unexpected for people. So many people think the market's extended and so many people think the market is going to crash. Not only is it not going to happen, it's, it's going to have the biggest move of its life in the next coming years. The market's going to have the biggest move that it's ever had in its life in the coming years. <laughs> This would have been very aggressive to buy it in here. Okay, I did not call the market long here, but I did see this and then I called it in here. But the stat was under the low of the day. And then, then later on here I said that is the low of the day. But there were some people that went long here. The stat was actually not small because this would have been too aggressive to do. But anyways, here this set up and went. And this is still actually, if you bought the market this morning on my call, it was a $2 move. So amazing. And it's never looked back for my price. So I, I called the market long in the first 10 minutes today and look at it. It's amazing. If the market pulls back at all today, you could buy it. I don't know if it will. <laughs> it's really late to buy it now here, though. I mean, if you were in my live trading room, you could have bought it this morning. The play was long. I did no shorts today. I didn't short anything today. I didn't trade. I didn't trade. There weren't any gaps to rate it for my system. I has nothing to do with the market, but certainly that, you know, I was aware of the fact the market was going to be bullish today. And I said there was a small chance it could do this today, and then it did it. And then I saw early that it was going to do it, and here it is. So we could continue. 209, 208, 208, 209. And it's just doing it. And it's the day after the holiday week. People were off next week. Now everybody's back at their desk, ready to go. Trade, making decisions, doing their things, and the market's getting bought. And there it is. Okay, the bit players are back. The people in charge of the market are back, and they're buying the market, and it's a fantastic move. So some, I just saw some amazing things here today looking at this chart in the SPY. The market will continue below shot of 2015. 300 is the big number that could still be hit this year. We will hit up over 225, even though that's a number a lot of people say that we're going to crash at that we haven't reached. We're not going to crash. Could we pull back there? Yes. We'll have to see how we act. We can make a new high in the market this week. I don't know yet to see how we act tomorrow. Major bullish day here today to start out the month. And really, it's second quarter earnings season starts this week as well. A lot of momentum in the market. And I told everyone that in the email letter in December. This year, this calendar year, look for a lot of momentum and volatility in the market. You, you can see this here. I just, you can see this here. This is just... Look at this. Huge volatility momentum here. I think this was a day of some FMC thing. 
Then look at what we did after this. Then everyone probably thought we were crashing through the floor of the earth, had a big red bar, went underneath the green bar here of the vine. Did this have any meaning? No. This isn't even a gap. Anyways, the bottom line is the market came in. Look, we've 100% retraced this now from over here already. So, And we've traced the drop off from last week in one day, like literally within minutes or hours. So, I mean, look at this. So really nice. Just this is this is volatility, people. This and this and this. You play the volatility in the right direction with institutional money, and that's how you make money in the market. That's how you make money as a trader, whether you day trade or swing trade or core trade. Look, no, look, no, no, no let up here. Look at this. I mean, this is so great. <sighs> it's so rare that you see the market power trend. I mean, this is rare that you see really the market power trend like this. This is I can't tell you how rare this day is that you would see the market power trend all day. You couldn't if you didn't, you could have. I, I'm, I have no words to say. <laughs> Just. <laughs> no one would have done this here. It wouldn't have made any sense. You did the call I called in here. You could have bought it again in here. Here, here you, had the, you had to buy the one-minute chart today, which I play. But to be able to buy the one-minute chart in the middle of the afternoon is so aggressive. And the only way it holds is if it's power trending, which, which the market is doing. But to buy the one-minute chart after 10 o'clock is aggressive. And I, I don't do it. I'm not in this long. I don't trade the afternoon. It's 105. But I'm just saying the only way you got long today is if you bought the one minute chart. You, you couldn't, there was no other setup anywhere. So great. And the market did blow over 207. I don't know where I got that number, but I knew it was a number and I knew it was real and it did. And after that is when we just took off like a rocket. So I have no idea where we're at tomorrow morning. Not a clue. No, it doesn't matter because I can read gaps. So I just wait till the morning and I look at it then and I see it and then I do it. But the predictions I'm making about the market for this calendar year are going to play out. And, and I'm telling you that this level here in the market is going to hold for a long time. It's going to hold for so long now that I'm almost like just if you saw my face, my, you know, I'm just, it's thrilling. This is, this is thrilling. This is thrilling actually to be able to see this. I, I have a gift and I'm I feel so grateful that I have the gift that I have to be able to read this so well, to accurately predict what it's going to do ahead of time, because that's how you make money. You don't make money after something does something, and then it's already done. You make money by being able to predict what it's going to do ahead of time, on the live day, and, and, and in the coming days, and in the future, and I have the ability to do that. The, the rating system, you rate it on the live day, you play it as a day trade. And it also can teach you how to trade stocks for the longer term, which is how I read the market. But my ability to see numbers that the SPY has never hit in its life before that don't even exist is me. And it's a skill. It's a gift. It's a gift that I see how to do this. And I don't know if anyone but me realizes how incredible this gift is. But I definitely have a talent to reprice action, which is why anyone that takes my class can learn more from me in two days than they've ever learned in any class in their life or for the whole time they've traded for 30 years. And that's why my class is, is a gift to the world, even though I'm charging for it. It's such amazing information uh, to be able to learn from one person in one weekend or to be even tra able to trade with me. So we'll go over this tomorrow in the live room in more detail. But this is incredible. And congratulations, everyone, today who already went long. Everyone that already went long today, congratulations, who took my call. I don't know how many people in the room did, but hopefully you're still in the trade and just write it out into the close. This is Melissa with the StockSwish.com. If you have any questions or want to sign up for the Golden Gap class this weekend, the class is April 11th and 12th. Email me at Melissa at the StockSwish.com. Incredible. Incredible market. Incredible gap. Incredible everything here I see. This is one of the best charts that exists on the planet right now in the U.S. stock market is the SPY. And if you'd like any more information, email me at melissa at the stockswish.com. Thanks, everyone. Have a great day.